Good morning, fellow gaming nerds. Welcome to the Whiplash Hell channel. Today we are playing Seven Days to Die Alpha 21, and it's day seven. Uh. All right, ladies and gentlemen, uh, after spending 20 plus hours in freaking COD over the past three days, I'm ready for a little slowdown. <laughs> Oh, man. I love that game, but after a couple of days of playing it, I need a break. And woman, just don't let it go. If she's home, I gotta play it. It's that womanhood prison I was talking about. <laughs> Alright, it's 5 a.m. on day 7. Remember, we're planning on having our horde night over here. Somewhere. I can't remember where it's at. <laughs> it's over here. I think right here. It's old passing gas. Already got it set up. I don't really have crap for uh, whippetry. Where is my whippetry? Oh, right here. Nope. Right here. I need to sort this. I've got um, this pipe rifle. I'm sure we'll probably use that. Maybe some Molotovs. What's the AK take? Is that 7.62? Yeah. We might use that. I'm not really sure. Probably not, because it, it just wastes bullets. So, 7.62. So, we'll take that. That. Pipe shotgun. That's crossbows. Oh, look. We've got uh, pipe bombs, too. Every time I take these, I never I never use them. It's because I forget about them. Uh, I've already got 64 arrows. Maybe I should make like 50 more in case I run out of ammo. I think that'll be plenty. I really don't think the first the first horde night's really going to be that extravagant. So uh, don't underestimate it, right? 92. Actually, let's just make 50. Might need the, the feathers for something else. But trying to use that. I keep forgetting, but... Uh... Let's repair these guys. I think this takes a repair kit. So we need to see what it takes to make repair kits. Forged iron and duct tape. So I guess... We, not, we need to start smelting some iron. Let's turn that on. Do I hate... I don't think I have any raw iron. Uh, forged steel. I've got some duct tape. Got a little bit. That. Let's see what we can make. 15. Well, I guess that's a good start, right? Good enough. Uh, so what are we going to do today? I guess we'll probably just do us a quest. I'll plant these trees. Might try to figure out... Hang on, let's go check our food situation. Got a couple of bacon eggs and some red tea. Uh, I think I might move these up top now. That's halfway done. I would imagine if I pull this up, that's going to deplete that to zero. I would imagine. Same way with that. So I think I'll wait half the day. I can go ahead and pull this one up. That's not too bad. All right. So I think what I'm going to do is stick these guys up here. Since I have no plans, chem station might go over here. We'll put them around this. Sounds like a plan anyway. So that like takes what? Six blocks up? So I wouldn't be able to put... I might be able to put one here. Uh, I don't know. Might have to stick one in each corner of the uh, of my little humble abode here. Also need to see what it's going to take to make. See what two, four, six, eight, ten, twelve, fourteen, sixteen, 
spikes. Might just go ahead and do that. Upgrade these doodahs. The whole, hot, the whole object of this base, and I'm not even sure. I should probably test it. The whole object of this base is for them to pound on the outside, and if anything tears up, you know, these break or fall. But all my goodies are pretty much right here on this column, and I need to protect it the most. Um, I'll never have a horde night here. The only way I will, uh, what do you call it, uh, get stuck here will be because I die and spawn back. Like on horde night. 32, I don't think that many. 16 is what I need. So we'll go ahead and do that. I think 16 would be enough. And if not, I'll make uh, 2, 4, 6, 2, 4, 6, 8 more to make a third row. But I was going to make, like, put the spikes like this. I might have to make a third row to keep them from jumping. Because mainly, if anything, they're going to hit right here. That's where they mainly hit, that second block. But anyway, the whole idea of this is for them to, to if they do anything, would be to knock this these ends out. All my goodies are on this square, so they would have to knock that out in order for it to fall. And I don't think it would fall unless it got down to two blocks. If it got down past two blocks, it probably will, which that's going to suck. But anyway, I hope hope for it to never catch catch me with my pants down. So I guess what happened is if I actually do die on a horde night and I spawn here... I'm probably going to head to the traders uh, and see if it'll uh, try to uh, boot me in and out of the, the building to, to avoid them till I can get somewhere else, which might be that silo or industrial tank. Okay, let's uh, plant some trees. I need to keep a close eye on that water. So we got several iron nodes here. Um... I'm just not sure how close I want to start mining next to my base. That's that's the problem. I think there's some more over here, I thought, anyway. Oh, I guess we could do a little bit of mining today. Be kind of a boring day. I got all the... Uh, shit. I have all the water filters and stuff that I want. I'm only going to use three unless it becomes a problem. Um, dew collectors. Uh, I seem to be finding quite a bit of water. And then at the same time, I'm using quite a bit. But I'm going to try to make this red tea. Um... Uh, as much as possible uh, to quench the thirst, if you know what I mean. So let's go plant our spikes. And then we might, yeah, I think we might just go ahead and do a little bit of mining. Usually my rule of thumb with seven days is to get resources like up to about noontime. And then um, after that... Uh, do some looting so yeah you know what I think I'd feel more comfortable if I did a third row that'd keep them from jumping I think yeah we'll go ahead and do that that makes me feel a little bit more comfortable to keep them out of that pocket uh oh quit turning So, I guess we need, what, two, four, six, eight more? A whiplash is a bit tired, even though I had a nap. Two, four, six, eight more. Okay, looks like we're going to need to get some wood. 
uh, I will eventually upgrade all this to from to cobblestone and concrete but you know that of course will take some time probably ought to get some more rock today oh wow I got a thousand that's pretty cool pretty cool so I feel a little bit more comfortable having those spikes there I still have the zombies on walk so we should be good see we got a couple iron nodes right here I just the problem is knowing which way the iron the veins are gonna go that's the problem so let's knock some of this down and see if we can't get some of smelting because I would love to um, love to get uh, a pickaxe instead of using this cotton pick and stone axe for this so we're probably just gonna do a little bit of lazy shit a little bit of grinding um, if you if you're here please make sure you say something in the um, the chat so I know you're here because I'm not watching it on um, my other computer like I have done in the past so I don't know if anybody's there watching so if you'd like to say something please say something and I know uh, I've been playing a lot of Call of Duty later uh, lately I like Call of Duty uh, I even like Hunt Showdown. I'd like to play some Hunt Showdown, but I would rather play with some friends. Can't always get them to play. Um, I don't really play Hunt Showdown like I used to because there are so many campers and what I call camping vaginas. People call it hunting. I call it being a pussy, but that's just my opinion. Um... The only time I really do any kind of camping is if I'm going solo. That I understand a little bit. It's kind of hard to go up against duos and trios by yourself. Oh, crap. You know, the stamina thing's going to kill me. It's one thing about Call of Duty. You don't have to worry about stamina. You just haul ass. It's really fast paced. <laughs> but it gets old after a couple of days. I can't believe I streamed like uh, 9 hours and 22 or 23 minutes the other day. It was pretty crazy. I had a lot of fun though. Had me a nice little buzz going before I went to bed. The sun's coming up. <laughs> but uh, anyway, it was a lot of fun. I don't really expect anybody to watch that for that long. So, iron is iron no matter what. See, in mods that I play, it has two separate things. It has like the raw kind, and it has this kind. This kind of iron is less effective. You can't get as much iron out of it as you can the raw. I gotta remember that. And see, in a lot of the mods, you don't have to smelt, which is really nice. <laughs> you don't have to do all that damn waiting. So, I can't believe that actually is giving us like 500. So, one thing I am curious about is if those um, dew collectors fill up faster during the rain. Dang, I swear to God, I thought a zombie was behind me. I truly did. Let's go check this one. It wasn't too far off. So now I can pick that one up. I just don't want the zombies beating on them. I put them down there when I first started, when I, the very first one I had, because I didn't, uh, I didn't have the space for it up here. So my idea was to put them all like next to each other on this. Wow, it let me. So I guess I can put the other one here. I can put the other one here, and then I'll be able to stand here and be able to access all three of them. Very nice. Um. 
Dixie Enormous was saying that uh, they put out a patch to where these actually bring up your heat map. I honestly didn't even know they still had the heat map in this game. I swear to God, you can leave the forge running 24-7 and you never see a screamer. The only time I ever see a screamer is to... Uh, I need to put some stone in there. only time I ever see a screamer uh, in the past is when I'm digging. Which we need, probably need some kind of emergency uh, base for that. You know? We probably do. Why does it look like that's just going absolutely nowhere? It's showing this, but... Okay. We'll get about a thousand of this. I'll put 500 in there. So I'll get about 500 more of this. And then we're going to go get some wood. I probably ought to put my gun back down here. Looks like I need some food and drink. Uh, how much does that add? 36 for food. Holy shit. I know that adds like 20-something for water, so... That should fill it up, fill us up quite nicely. We'll just have to keep on getting those eggs. Bacon and eggs. Actually, could see if my buddies are online. That's a very good possibility. They could be. They won't play this with me, but they might actually keep me uh, chit chatting. It's kind of boring streaming, uh, grinding. Surprised we're not cold with it raining. Ooh, wow, that food and that uh, tea is keeping my stamina up. That's really nice. We get us a, uh, I need to see my points. Let's get this 500 more, uh, iron, and, uh, check out our points here. Six freaking points, and I've not spent them yet. What is wrong with you, Whiplash? What is wrong with you? I've been busy. Um, the night that I played for like nine hours of COD, uh, the next day I was pretty wore out. I tried to play with my grandson for a couple hours, and I did play with my grandson a couple hours, but I was so exhausted. So exhausted. Alright, let's go check this right quick. almost done I mean it's just right there you know what it almost seems like it does fill up faster when it's raining because it, it didn't take no time that makes sense I like that I don't like the I don't like this dew collector shit but <laughs> it is uh I don't like the fact that we can't fill up our gla our glasses at the uh, watering hoe anymore. I guess that's pretty much what I don't like. The dew collector thing is kind of cool, but not being able to pick up water somewhere, is, it's not cool. But I can live with it. So, if anything, I need to put in some stone. I thought I'm going to bring this out and put in about half the stone. That way we have that in there. Sand I'm not really too worried about at the moment. But uh, we'll let that smelt up right nice. And uh, 
put this shit up. Where should we put our weapons? I think I'm gonna put those on this side. Because... I don't have anything else. I'll split this up. See about... Guns... <coughs> oh, excuse me. Mm. Yeah, we'll put the melee bombs and arrows over here. Sounds good. So we got rid of that. And all this good stuff here. Close. Mods and parts, like parts to make whippetry and whatnot. Uh, military armor parts. I guess I'll put that with the clothing. Usually the die. I'm not really sure what to do with the die in this game. No sale price and scrap. It's literally just to change the color of something. See, in mods, you can use that to make ink to write your own uh, classes. Paper classes for different classes and types that you want to go into. So I usually put that with the chem stuff. Uh, but I'll throw it up here for now. Oh, gunpowder that goes with the gunage. Uh, which is here. Alright, I, I know I can write on that, folks. But I still haven't really sorted out how I want to do the sorting in this game just yet. I still think I've got one more up here. Yeah, I'll put... This kind of stuff. Car stuff. Ooh, what's the oil shell doing in there? That, was, that must have been a mishap. Car stuff. Die. Actually... Not sure what to call it. That can go. I usually call this like my utility drawer or something. All right. Good enough. And the foods in here. I usually keep food and drink separate, but being that this is such a big box, I'll probably keep it together. Got a lot of good stuff there. I think I'll take that because that's a lot. That's quite filling too. And we need some chrysanthemum. Look at all that cotton picking uh, meat. I didn't realize I had that much. Uh, yeah, I think we need to hit some trees. We can knock this out and get it out of our way now because they're empty, right? Yes, so we can knock these out of our way. Actually, you know, I honestly don't even know if I can make a pickaxe yet. Hello, come in. Track. So we'll definitely need duct tape, leather, 20 forged iron. That would be lovely to have. Can we make 20 forged iron yet? 72. Don't want to totally dump it. We'll just make 20 for now. We'll make it as we need it. And then I think I'll need to make a few more duct tape. And I can't remember what the duct tape takes. I have some leather somewhere. Mm. To glue and cloth. I don't think I have any glue. No. Well, we might be running into a problem here. Campfire. Bone and water. Ooh, bone and water. K 
chem station. It's bone and water or ear of super corn and water. I guess I've been finding enough glue to make what I've needed. I don't remember doing a seven bone and at least it's only one water I think I can spare that gun it hit the wrong freaking button again hello come in cloth and glue so it's just one on one Crap, what am I looking for? Oh, you only need two duct tape. Duct tape, thank God. All right, good. Got plenty of leather. So duct tape and wood. And just a few more. I hope I can make it. Honestly, don't even know. Why don't we look at our skill points right quick? Since I have so many, I think I've leveled up twice in strength. I think I'm going to put one in each attribute. I don't know if that's good or bad, but that will that's one of the things I kind of go back and forth between. I honestly did not realize that I had so much. But anyway, yeah, let's go ahead and do that. You will still, you are still unaware of most things around you. Deal 210% headshot damage and have 10% chance to dismember with rifles, explosives, spears, and tools governed by salvage operations. You feel a little better than you used to. Deal 210% headshot damage and... How do they figure this? 210% is quite a bit. Agility. Intellect. I still got two more. What about advanced engineering? You are now out of the Stone Age and an apprentice... apprentice Engineer, gain 15% XP from electrical trap kills. Items craft 20% faster at the forge. Well, that would be nice. How about Grease Monkey? I'll be honest with you. About the only thing I'm interested in is the, is the mini bike. I'm happy with the mini bike. I like the motorcycle, don't get me wrong, but... I guess we have to buy our way up to the motorcycle if I'm going to do that. I don't know. I'll, I'll debate the the motorcycle when we get there. But I would love to have the mini bike. Lucky looter. I already got one in that. Spear. Re really like to level up the, or use the shotgun but right now I'm using a rifle what does that fall under mother load we're gonna be doing a lot of that I'll put the last one there guys a lot of harvesting so that'd be nice so this should be done with that I guess I'll put that clay back in there so we used a lot of that Oh, actually, we have quite a bit of clay in there. It's stone. Iron. Maybe I should put the iron. Yeah. I'd say that's probably the better bet. Be the better bet. I'm still going to split this in half. I'm not sure if you need the... Uh, I'll need that for anything else. You should be able to shift-click that in there. I don't know why it's not like that anymore. Um, I'll let that burn out. That sounds good. Let's make our pickaxe. Boom. Three minutes and we'll have a pickaxe and we can get, 
Actually, I'll have to get rid of the shovel or put it in my backpack. I'm keeping all this on me, folks. I can get rid of the torch, though. Uh, torch. Can we put that up here on the storage box? Will that will that work? How in the sand blazes is that working? Is it because it's all writable, isn't it? Yeah, I bet it's because it's writable. Okay, so... <laughs> that didn't work out quite like I anticipated. Uh-oh, look, we're getting a... We can go get that. Airdrop. I guess we'll just put it up on the edge. That way, I hope I don't burn my butt getting up there. <laughs> that would be quite funny. All right. I think we're going to go get a little bit of wood. Yeah, we really need some wood. Still got a minute and a half. I think I'm going to go on the other side of the trailer. Shoot. Uh-oh. We got some company. Killing the name of three swats. Yelpers. Let's go knock down a couple trees over here. Having to put that point in the mud load to be nice. I just don't hold, I just I just kind of hope that I don't forget it's freaking horde night. You know what? And I done forgot about my bicycle. yet on the food food 85 yeah, I'm, I'm gonna go ahead and use that and drink some red tea this should fill me up nicely probably ought to check into making a fire axe see a rabbit over there by that house. Checking for them eggs. Checking for the eggs. I think it's already noon. Man, time flies and you're having fun. Okay, since we got rid of the torch, what we're going to do is move everything down. Put that down here. Actually, I think I'm going to put the gun here. A little easier to reach that. And... I think that's typically about the way I do it. And how much wood we got? Seven twenty. Let's get a little bit more. I think we will go ahead and get us a a quest. Maybe do one quest and then we'll go over there and scout out our uh horde base. Make sure it all still looks kosher. Probably ought to put up a couple more ladders around the base. Flash is going to stream. 
original plan was a stream till womanhood gets up for work, which would be about 5 a.m., but I don't know if I'm going to last. My eyes are burning pretty bad. I guess I have overindulged in the cod too much. That's okay. Today is early Tuesday morning. Happy 4th of July to everyone if you live in America. Happy Independence Day. Oh, we got a little bit of eggs there. I would like to make nothing but bacon and eggs, but I don't think it's going to happen that way, right? I think, I don't know if you can buy eggs or not. Trader should definitely be open, so let's go pay a visit to him and uh, get us a quest, something close. I'm at least going to do Horde Night, right? At least going to do that. we do horde night then um, I might go ahead and get off here I don't know like I said my eyes are burning really bad I don't understand why because they weren't burning earlier like before I got on it's kind of strange what do you want uh, jobs Restore power. That's night only. Wouldn't that be interesting to do on a horde night? Maybe when I'm a little stronger. Or like maybe when I have some real armor. Some like military armor or leather armor. <coughs> we got a fetch hey, quest. Jerk, you need some work. Or don't just stand there. Just up your ass. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Let's go grab our bike. I keep forgetting that I have that, right? right there. Maybe we ought to take some time and mow some of our grass. Yeah, we'll just let that self burn itself out. Even if the... Oh, wow. The uh, iron's almost done. Do I have any sand at all? Yeah. Picked it along the way. We can uh, put that in there. I guess I should empty all this out. That way we'll get us a little bit, little bit of stuff that's going, right? Uh, what else? Gunpowder needs to be put up. That can go in there. Actually, I think I put that in the other one. Food stuff is lead. Where have I been putting my dupe coins? What's my... There it is. Got plenty of drink. Alright. So... Alright, let's roll. Making my way downtown. La 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 la. Can't remember the words. Oh, well, we still got the stamina thing going. That's really nice. We'll have to be drinking the red tea tonight. I said, looking at making some more red tea. Now probably would have been the time to do it because it takes for freaking ever to do, right? All right. Yeah, whiplash right up into the front door. Alright. And no, I don't like looting the buildings twice. It's boring. I know a lot of people do that. But I don't. I might loot a few things on the outside. Just like 
this kind of stuff because that'll give you something to read. Fully automatic mode has an increasing chance to ragdoll an enemy with each hit. Hell yeah. So now that should reset. Now that kind of stuff I don't mind doing. I think we're getting a horde. We're getting a little bit of lag. Let's let's hang on a second. Take a look, see around. You tried there. But not today, Satan. I strain. I strain. Alright. Watch it be coming from behind me. That's alright. We'll we'll make do. We will make do. Now we're gonna we're gonna prep for poochies. What am I doing? Four Prepping for poochies. Which I don't know why I do this. I always go into panic mode and screw up. I missed. I think it's because of the slant. There we go. I barely made it. Alright, well they kind of want you to go in through here so you'll have a hard time getting out. And... Alright. Got the water going on. Oh, put I love that effect. I know that might sound crazy and stupid, but I love the fact that the water's putting the fire out. That makes it a little bit like more realistic and whatnot, right? I know that's stupid, but I like that. Oh, I'm hitting. I'm, am I getting water? I like. I like that. You're hearing the sloshing noises. We get to use it. Well, that was quick. We're gonna still loot this place. That looks like Pringles. Why would you keep bone in a cupboard? Should I be wrenching this stuff? Get that sneak damage. You only get sneak damage if there's that they're unaware of you. Remember that. Somebody got eight in their own kitchen. Poor guy. Gal. It's full of sand. Uh so worried about this earlier why not just get it? I, I'm so glad that they didn't make it such a burden to get that shit I'm kind of disappointed not being able to loot garbage cans though or I know that might sound stupid but that was like a thing you know uh oh at least it's not pushies I can do a little table dance you want a table dance there buddy skater punk man this is doing so much more damage. I'm, I'm almost tempted to do a to go up to warrior level. It would probably be a mistake. I get on the door, yo. Feeling pretty confident. You see the garbage cans full. Oh, 
Oh, look, that's got nails in it. So garbage can, or where do you find the nails? I can make nails now. See, before I could not. Any yay who's in here? Will you take that before Horde Night? I got a feeling I'm going to get my ass kicked tonight. I'm not really expecting much because usually the first Horde Night is not very, like, worrisome. But I'm still nervous because... I also, when I first started playing Alpha 21, was not expecting to have to switch down to Nomad level when I'm so used to playing Warrior. It was, it was a big... Uh, it was a big change for me. It was like, like I'd been defeated or something, you know? Oh, yeah? Trying to sneak up on... Oh, bitch! Oh, man! I'm bleeding out! Fucker, I got a concussion, too! Die gun, see, that's what you get for being overconfident. That's what I was talking about. I was just fucking talking about it. My first hit on the girl upstairs was a right click, which was a power, you know, hit. I thought it would have done, knocked her back, and it didn't. So, I think I have some pain medication at home. Obviously, do not have it on me. But we're going to have to gather some chrysanthemum to make some more, uh, uh, what do you call it? Red tea. Sorry. I'm a little... I'm stuttering now because she got me all in the rambling. Damn women. That's what they do to you. Get in your head. Dang. No. Ooh, we got an actual knife. It's only a level one. Melee, 11.9. This actually would do more. Uh, if I would put the, uh, yeah, this would actually do more if I would put the, uh, what do you call it, serrated blade mod in it. Sorry, I can't think. Whiplash's brain is not functioning properly at the moment. Okay. Okay. Trail it back through. Oh, maybe I should... Am I infected too? I don't think I... I told you he was getting a fucking horde. What'd I tell you? What did I tell you? Well, since I can return to the trader, we can go downstairs and finish looting this in a moment. But right now, we've got to get outside. And how about we just... Okay. Can we open the door and get out? Oh, shit! No! Yeah, damn floppy boobies. Okay, come on. No, it's just one. Where'd he come from? Okay, now I'm all scared again. And it shows. Wigging out over one zombie. Oh, daggunyas. Now I gotta wake my way back upstairs. How'd I get up there? Over here, over here. There we go. Round and around we go. When it stops, nobody knows. Hey, come. It's already 4.30, man. Uh, we probably ought to get the fuck out of here. Time we get back, unload, make some more tea, take some pills, because the concussion is not going to help me during horde night. So, let's, uh, hey, gun it. There's, there it is. I keep hitting the wrong fucking button. I'm getting really bad about it. I don't know why I keep doing it. 
Here's the goodies. Okay, come on. Let's do it. Look at them cod moves. Look at them cod moves. You ain't got nothing on this. You ain't got nothing on this. Okay, we'll wait. Is that the kitchen? I never noticed that. Okay, I'm not seeing anything hidden anymore. Uh, what we got here? Improves medical crafting skill. Hell yeah, we're gonna have to check some of this shit out later. Kind of in a hurry right now. Probably don't need to be, but... Power attacks increase chance of knocking down your enemies. See, that's what I needed a minute ago. I seriously thought that would have knocked her back, but... Alright, improves club crafting skill. We definitely needed that. Yeah, two wheels. Oh, the bandolier mod. High power and ammunition. The most powerful handgun in the world just got more powerful. You can craft a high power 44 Magnum ammunition. I don't know why that's so hard for me to say. A level 5 shotgun. Are you kidding? It's a pipe shotgun. I mean, it's nothing fancy, but I mean, it's better than nothing. Uh, maybe I ought to eat some food. I really don't want to dump any of this. But I want that bandolier mod. I need all of this. I gotta just dump that out. I want that. I definitely want the shotgun, so I gotta dump something else. How about the spring? We'll scrap it. Bam. Is there anything else back here? Okay. As much as I would love to sit here and gather the resources, I think we're gonna roll. I'm not even sure I could put that. Oh, I can. Hell yeah. That helps with reload time, I think. Can we look at it? I guess I should have looked at it before I put it in there, but... No. I guess we can look it up. Bandolier mod... Reload 15% faster. The effects do not stack, but it can be installed into any chest or leg armor. All right. I guess we could have went out that way. Uh, where did the damn garage go? Oh, here it is. Rid of the paper. Potato seeds a little bit more important. All right, let's grab the bicycle. I don't even think there goes that concussion. So I guess what I'm gonna do is go back to the house, unload, then go to the trader, see if we've got time enough to go out to that uh, airdrop. I don't know if we're going to have time. Go to the house first, empty out, because I'm completely freaking full. I ought to check into making some cobblestone so I could at least upgrade the uh, bottom of my base. Yeah, slow as hell. We know all about it. Don't have nothing there. Hmm. Huh. Interesting. 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 I'm really surprised. What is that broken glass can go in there? Food stuff. I actually might go sell that because I never use the wraps any darn way.
Bullet tips and bullets. Food. Actually gonna swap out this knife. Uh, modify. Take the serrated blade out. Uh, modify that. Put the cell serrated blade it out. I might get it out in a minute. Where should I put tools? Uh, where is my food and agua? I'll go ahead and make some red tea. Go get that going. Ten minutes for that shit. Holy crap. It takes forever. Uh, put the sand in here. Might as well, right? What else would I need in there? Got some lead. Do I have any more lead in here? I feel like if I don't have these two filled while it's on, that I'm just wasting it. I really can probably just turn it off right now. Uh, so tonight I will be using that. I don't believe I have any mods. Pipe rifle I already have. Uh, probably be taking this ammo, although I think I'm going to split it in half. Keep that. We can always make a pipe pistol for this. Uh, taters. Use that. Use this. Drink one of these. And see about medicine. I have one. Let's use it. That should get rid of our concussion. I hate doing that, but because it's going to drain me dry on liquids. Hydration is really going to be getting sucked down right now. Um, trader stuff is, you know what, I might just keep, be keeping seeds in here. We, we will need to make us a farm. Alright, I think I'm just gonna, put tools in here, I guess. I'll probably change that, but let's run over here and get our goodies, whatever it might be. <clears throat> And, uh, I'm not really sure if I have enough time to go all the way out there. I really don't. Mm. Oh, a fire axe. You know... I don't think you could really use a fire axe on everything, but crafting skill and magazine bundle sounds good. I don't know, toss up, crafting skill, iron, fire axe. Uh, I'd like to have both. Why can't I have both? I've been a good boy. Just a bunch of work for you, you mean old fart. I think the crafting skill magazine would be good right now. I could probably make a fire axe. There we go. Alright. Oh, you want a guarantee, huh? Well, maybe you should try Shamway. <laughs> I might just do that, yo fart. See, I'm gonna need another one of these. Alright, let's check out our crafting skill. 
Improves medical crafting. Two of those. Improves armor crafting. Two of those. Looks like I opened something up when you hear that little thing. Improves explosion crafting skill. Fire, forges, lock picking, airdrops, and cold weather. So I tell you what, let's go ahead and take these little doodahs. We got our repair kits. Um, take our bombs. Put our Duke coins up. Da, 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 da. I got one piece of food. I'm actually pretty good on food right now. See, I'm I'm still not on water because I'm freaking pain pills drain ya. Seven o'clock, so I got three hours, and that's 465 meters away. So, do we have time or not? That's probably gonna. Uh, all right, we're gonna try it. We'll be on a wing and a prayer. We come back. We probably got time. I'm just freaking out because it's the first horde night. Don't know if I'm gonna die yet. Have a little faith, right? I'm kind of curious if they're going to be running or not. Because in Feral Zombies, I don't think it's going to matter. I really don't. I think there's going to be like a half ass jog slash run. Because if they're not running, I will probably get down on the ground. Have a little target practice. But we'll see. Alright, what we got? Proves how bow crafting. Hell yeah, that would be nice. We got some antibiotics. Oh, we got us a hammer. What's this? Crafting skill? Looks like I just got... Uh-oh. I just got one of these boxes. Four hits to the head does it every time. Proves repair tool crafting skill. Improves harvesting tool crafting skill. And what we got here? Improves robotics crafting skill. I don't really use it, but it is what it is. I definitely won't throw them away. I'll use, uh, I'll read them until I fill up the book level. Uh, going back to the house now. It's not even eight o'clock yet. I'm not freaking out over nothing. want to try something guys here's a zombie to try it out on one thing I do when they're coming to me and they fumble to me see how he fumbles to me all right he fell down I'm gonna have to wait they start coming at you you got to be careful how you do it if they fumble to you go around them real quick it doesn't always work, but you gotta you gotta sidestep as you do it, guys. Not just turn your face. 
You have to sidestep at the same time. Or it won't work. Yeah, see, I was afraid one more hit would kill him. Here's another one. I ain't got much time. Yeah, see if he does it. That's what I was talking about. I don't know if any... I was trying to explain it to uh, Dixie Normus the other day. But you gotta, like, turn and sidestep at the same time. And I think you, like go through it but that's what I try to do when they start fumbling really fast towards you that's what I do or what I try to do but I guess we need to go now it's, it's like past 8 o'clock but I was trying to explain that to Dixie Normus on his stream the other day, and I'm not really sure that if he saw or knew, understood what I was talking about. They start fumbling towards you. Go towards them, but sidestep and turn at the same time, just like a quick maneuver. Um, you Sometimes you will get hit, no lie, you will get hit. Uh, but it's better than letting them come directly into you, because you will get either smacked or you will get bit. Uh, I wasn't sure if they uh, knew that the zombies bite too, because they do. So I guess I'm ready to rock, guys. Um, we're going to use this. Put the pipe wrench up here, the shotgun here, and this, and this up here, and we'll put our explosives there. I'm not very good with explosives because I have a horrible, see I think we're already loaded there. I have a horrible habit of uh, thinking I'm playing COD and um, uh, not COD but something else I play. It shows the arc. So. I'm going to go this way. I can't remember exactly where it's at. I, sh I should mark it roughly. I want to say it's... If that ain't it, it's close by that. <clears throat> we have too many running zombies. Uh... We'll play the chicken run method. I love the chicken run method. It's a lot more fun than standing up on the top down uh, the uh, tower defense method. I don't know about you guys, but it's boring as fuck to me. I was close. It was the wrong building, but it was right here. Yeah, it's boring as hell having a horde knight doing a tower defense. To me, it is. So, da, 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 especially when you run out of ammo. So basically, let's put up some more. I guess got a feeling they're going to get up there, and then it's fine if they do. We'll run off. I need at least one more. Hopefully this doesn't fall. Blah blah. Okay, we need at least one over here. There we go. Never stay around your ladders because they can get on them, folks. If you go up the ladder and they're with you, make sure you run away from the ladder. Okay, folks, so this is this is it. We got like an hour. Not much time. I think I am going to pause it. Get me something to drink. Smoke a cigarette real quick. But, 
uh, anyway, Dixie Norman's played quite a bit this uh, past few days. I watched what I could, but I was streaming myself, so it was kind of hard to stay with him for very long. There's one ideal I would love to pitch across other content creators. Old Dixie Normus plays a lot of Rust and DayZ, so he's used to a lot of PvP. Uh, I'm not very good at PvP. If you watched me play COD, you would understand this. But I've never seen content creators do PvP on YouTube. And I think it would be a hit with people. I could be wrong. I, don't, I think seven. I'm not really sure how many PvP players there are out there on Seven Days to Die, but um, I think it would be a great idea uh, for two content creators to do that. You know, just all in the name of fun, not to be too competitive, but to. Uh, uh, Maybe lay out some rules. I don't know what the rules are. Is it the zombie apocalypse? If you play like you played in COD or any other survival game, like Rust or DayZ, it's every man for himself. <laughs> but I think it would be kind of cool to see two content creators do that. All right, I'm going to pause this for a second, and I'm going to burn one. I'll try to make it quick, and we'll come back and have this horde night, folks. Fast forward about five minutes.
All right, folks, I'm back. I need to make a B right back uh, picture so I can put up while I'm away for a few minutes. No skill points. Harvesting tools. So I can make a level two. Oh, 14 is a level two. Okay. Steel tools. Those are nice. Clubs. I can make a level three and one more. I can't even make a baseball bat yet. You have to have 11 of those. That's what I want right there, that steel club. Man, that thing's badass. 39. Holy snikes. Well, they definitely found a way to increase the length of your game, right? Bows. Compound bow 39, compound cross. Uh oh, here we go, guys. Now I'm just going to kind of sit out front here and wait. They're, they're walking, half ass running. Totally missed. So I guess we could probably get down. We could drink some. Uh, I don't even think I'm hitting them. Boy, for zombies being structural engineers, they aren't very smart. They're not even hitting the building I'm on. So this poor gun's gonna get a workout tonight. Uh. I don't think I need any food yet. Let's go ahead and drink one of these. That'll help with stamina. Could use some anyway. And I think I'm just going to go ahead and jump down there. At least one shot's killing them to the head, right? I just was kind of unsure about ferals. Let's see how this is going to roll. Yeah, I think we're going to be alright probably could just use a freaking club and save my ammo I think I'm going to yeah see I like doing this when they're running Yeah. Of course, this is almost like getting a wandering horde, ain't it? We could have had this at the base. I just was unsure about how uh, how it was going to be. We might turn everything back to normal and start playing that way. Oh, loot bag. See, doing it this way also give you time to loot. Another way of looking at it. Maybe I should keep them away from my bike. I was going to practice this, remember? See how he fumbles to you? Okay, gotcha, gotcha, total miss, 
Total miss. Total miss again. Got one coming up on the right. Oh, I saw that miss. Oh, bad, bad, bad. Practice makes perfect, right? What's up? All right. A dag on red tees like a like a uh, drug, ain't it? I mean, it's not even bothered my stamina yet. All right, a little bit more practice with the bow. Rage mode. In case you all didn't know, when these zombies take off running like that, it's at rage mode. It's more like a jog, not a run, but or a sprint. Oh, she got me. Little winch. I think I've missed more than I've than I've hit tonight. Why can't I pick up my arrow, please? Pick pick up my arrow. Oh shit, that was my fault. Totally my fault. Practice. Totally miss. Zig when I should have zagged. Hell yeah. Edgar getting a little too close there, compadre. You ought to try to do this shit while they're running. Not easy. Definitely presents a challenge. Especially when you don't have no stamina. I hear some more coming. I'm really surprised I'm getting as many as I've got. But that's okay. Oh man, Zig when I said zagged. Excuse me. I gotta pick a timeout. Gotta pick up the arrows. Waiting for the poochies to come. Cause I know they will run. Oh good shot right in the head egg head. Like butter? RK. Uh oh. Did that a little too soon. I was trying to pick up the arrow. Y'all getting a little slow. Bring it on, floppy boobies. I get a little bit better at that. I guess I ought to aim for her floppy boobies. There you go. Boom! It went through. <laughs> went under her armpit, man. Oh, man. I thought she got me there. I really did. Hell yeah. Yeah, I think we're going to be turning. Oh! I think it's gonna be turning the normal back on. Try out the normal roast, normal speeds. I just hate doing any, not being able to do anything at night. Oh. 
I'm out of stamina, holy shit. Alright, let's drink another red tea. That should help with that right nicely. And that that took his head off, man. That was awesome. Trick on this bow is not to hold it too long. Let go when you have a. Don't try to sit there and aim so much. If you got it, or if you got a shot, aim in the chest, I guess. Hell yeah. Don't tell me that's it. I want more. Give me more. Give me more. I think that's it, guys. <laughs> uh, I definitely did not need the Molotovs or anything. Could definitely handle the walking speeds for sure. Metal chain mod, don't have enough knockdown power. Learn to craft a metal chain modification to increase your stock on the wheelchair business. Hell yeah. So I guess it's over with. I usually hoard night on vanilla flavor. It's not that long. Uh, if you were playing Darkness Falls, it's quite literally from from 10 o'clock at night till 4 o'clock in the morning and then you think it's over and it's not then another horde shows up and you gotta fight them and it's worse than the whole horde night so yeah it's pretty crazy so we'll definitely use that in the future because I think I think I'm gonna try to turn everything back to normal the next uh, the next day or the next time I uh, stream I think we're gonna go back to the house. Oh wait, a minute. we got we got one in the building. So we had a we had a stray get inside. Did we? I guess we did. So yeah, like I said, we'll use this in the future. Uh, I'm not sure if or when I will build my base because like I said, I don't like the top down I really don't like this at all. I don't like playing a horde knight on, on the tower defense. I really don't. It's so fucking boring. I Can handle that that was definitely a lot more fun. So Maybe we'll we'll do what I said and I'll switch it back to like maybe a, a sprint or a jog I'm not really maybe a jog. We'll try that but I definitely want, uh, oh man, a little bit more action, right? So we can put, oh wait a minute, I need to keep that. Definitely have a little bit more fun with it. Cut you, man. Oh, there's a deary. Aim a little high. Oh, aim a lot high. Now, nah, fuck. Oh, wow. One shot with the freaking bow. Cool. Oh, I thought I left my bike up here. Oh no, I remember. <laughs> Horde night's still going and I don't have any damn zombies. 
hilarious. That is freaking hilarious. I guess, uh, I think I'm just gonna maybe do a little resource gathering till morning. I think we'll be done with it. Uh, da 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 da. Okay, today is July 4th. I do not go back to work till July 5th. I'm not sure I'll be working 12 hours a day. But through the week, I'm going to still stop, try to stick with the plan. Through the week, I'm going to play Seven Days to Die, maybe State of Decay 2. I'm going to play different games. And uh, on the weekends, I'll probably be playing COD. The little lady likes to play COD with me. And I enjoy playing with her. We have a good time. Can be aggravating too, but we we do have a good time. Uh, food stuff is. I think I already have a level three padding. Yes, leg armor. Um. Uh. Goes together, that goes together. I might keep this for extra food stuff. Is. You know what? I think I'll just go ahead and use this. Eat the dog food. Oh, I got two of those. Well, eat it up, my friend. Eat it up. Put this down here. Uh, where am I going to put the tools? I usually don't like keep the hammer on me. I still haven't made up my mind. I guess I'll put tools in here. Knuckles. I sewed those. Where did I put that knife? Yeah. There we go. Sorry. Still kind of sorting this stuff out. On how I want to do this. Medicine. Where did I have clothing? I think it was over here. No. No. There it is. Clothing and armor. Alright, just two more things. I don't have anything in this middle one, right? Oh yeah, I do. It's kind of an odd place. What about this one? That's got stuff is. That's got stuff is. Kind of want to split up the meds and seeds because there's so many di different types of seeds. So many different types of seeds. Would really like to put tools with resources, maybe. Maybe in here for right now. I think that fits it a little bit better anyway. Alright. Made up my mind. So. Medicine we'll put here. Medicine, 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 medicine. Any kind of pills. Really don't mind keeping Duke coins in there. Usually I put that with the clothing though. Medicine. Aloe Cree, that's medicine. Even though aloe really, that seed goes in there. Well look, I've got six eggs I stuck in here and didn't even realize it. Coffee beans, that should go with food. So should this. I don't know. Getting a little haphazard with my sorting. Get 
again. There we go. That'll work. Speaking of which, uh, I think I'm good on food and water for right now, but I do kind of want to check these. Oh, wow, two. Hell yeah. Burning it up. Six of those babies. Check that out. I think three is probably going to fit it for me for right now. Unless I need it to make, uh, need an extra one so I can make uh, glue. I think it's glue where I need the water. I got seven eggs. Maybe I should make some bacon and eggs. And maybe go out here and, uh, Collect some more chrysanthemum. And make some uh, more red tea. Should be able to do that. Could start mowing our grass. would like to clear out the area directly under the base for sure so it looks all nice and neat like let's go ahead and gather some chrysanthemum and we'll go ahead and get that on the burner I suppose oh look goldenrod I, that almost seems like a luxury anymore A lot of this stuff spawns, there's really no excuse for not having it, other than the lack of taking the time to get it, right? All right. How about we clear out some of this grass? That way I might actually be able to see my bicycle. Oops. No! I wasn't even close to it. We'll uh, clear out this side a little bit more because I usually park over here. Eighty-five. I must have knocked that down. That's okay. It just takes a repair kit to fix it. It's not that big a boo, uh, big a deal. All right. Let's grab that water and. Yeah, I'll use all that dang water for for red tea. It gives the most hydration of what I can make right now, so I'll definitely do that. Matter of fact, I think I got to go ahead and boil that. Give us a little extra. Boom. 
Bam. 20 minutes. Oh my god, that takes forever. It's a lot of wood. Tygon, it's already four almost. So, just out of curiosity, how many zomboys have I killed? 257 in seven days. I'm on Whiplash 4.0. I used to used to make graveyards for my whiplashes and I'd put a sign on it saying whiplash 1.0 taught us something about not dying you know however I died and I can't remember the first one I died to on this was I got stuck in a bathroom and wedged between zombies on this one the second one I don't remember but the third one was because of the poochies so I would write like damn poochies I don't remember the second time how I died. Okay, one thing I would like to do is put some kind of cover over this. Nothing fancy, just... I don't know. What do they have? What about awnings? How do you spell that? I thought that spelled with an A. I fucking I guess the next thing I ought to work for is a workbench. So, I've got to find four more books of reading Forged Ahead. That's what I gotta do. Four more books of Forged Ahead. Wow, there's not much in here for making anything. Alright guys, y'all didn't see this cheat menu. I'm not going to get anything out. I just want to see something real quick. Because I can't remember what they're called. And I would know it if I saw it. Brick, wood, concrete, steel, cloth. Uh, what about... Well, that's furniture. Trim. Bulletproof, other, cobblestone, a lot of times I'll just thumb through it like this just to look, because everything's going to be fucking different. Like I said, I'm not going to get anything out. Ooh, you can make spaghetti? Huh, isn't that interesting? All the different types of books. Wow, that's a lot. Mods. A lot of mods. Ooh, what's this? Oh, the gun save. Sorry, I guess we're starting to get to the stuff. Different types of blocks. Here's the building stuff. Mm -hmm. 
be my luck what I'm looking for. I probably can't even fucking make it. Now, if I'm going to use it, I'll end up having to pull it out of the creative menu. I mean, it would be serve no benefit other than, you know, like looks. That's it. Red biohazard tent cap left. See, something like this is what I would want. Basically, what I want to kind of do is make some kind of tarp looking tent little thing over top of this. Yeah, see, I want to see what this looks like, guys. I think it's just a block. Yeah, so that's kind of cool. I don't think you can make anything like that. Oh, falling off the side. I don't know. I just basically want to make a little tarp looking thing over top of this. Maybe really just on this front side, because I think I may have to leave this open for the rain. Not really sure, to be honest with you, but... Anyway, we'll see. Some thinking about it, but I think I am going to go ahead and go. Let's turn this back off. Not that it matters. See, I didn't use it. I'm, I'm happy with the way that it is, really. I was just trying to give you give it a little bit more of a decorative value. Make it look a little bit more homey. Maybe like a, just a little tarp looking thing over top of this. And then maybe out far enough to cover out to the second square around this whole thing. That's, that's really about it. Make some like pole. 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 I don't think you can look it up like that. It's in the... It's in like the blocks, I guess. Like a center pole. Alright, hang on a second. I didn't think I actually selected it, but hey. Definitely don't think it's going to hurt anything. I did it again. <laughs> like that. Like do it twice over. And then bring something out to about the edge of this. Just for a covering, maybe make some um, wooden fences. Be almost like a giant porch. I think it would look kind of cool. Nothing, it's not really fancy, and it's to my taste anyway. I don't know. We'll see. See, the thing is, I want it to drape, you know, like that would go there. Can I stand on this? Okay. So that's on the outside. So I would want it to drape down, and I don't think you can do anything like that. I 
I don't know why I'm doing this right now. I was going to go. <laughs> I just tried to get a feel to see what it would look like. Yeah, see, I would think it would be cool. If you could have something draped from there down to here, I just don't know how you could get it to work. And then maybe have some kind of, like, uh, old fence... Uh, not like that. I wonder if they have anything like. I don't think this would, the bars would look cooler as a, a fence than it would be. Oh, this would look good. Not necessarily the catwalk itself, but. Catwalks. I would just want the railing. Yeah, like this. Oh, it's like slanted. Catwalk railing diagonal left. Catwalk version one railing. Yeah, something like that. And let me guess, I can't do that because the block's there, so I'd have to turn those around. Just, you know. I don't know, something to think about. I don't know what to do. I guess it could probably use some kind of roofing. Uh-oh. Am I getting a... Am I getting a horde? What's going on? With, oh, I'm getting a freaking animal horde. Alright. Here we go. I wonder how many there are. I saw two for sure. We're gonna die. I'm getting hit, wait. Never mind, guys. Holy fuck. <laughs> I can't believe there was that many. I cannot believe there was that many. I have no whippetry up here either. Uh, wait a minute, I have the shotgun. I have the shotgun. I have this. I'm tearing my shit up. Catching myself on fire. Do I have anything I can drink? Oh my god. I did not expect that many. See, that's right there is why I put up the spikes. Because they would have tore out that wood. My wood backing there. Or my wood pillar. They would tore it out bigger than shit. Still one more left. Holy crap. I was expecting maybe three. Not one, two, three, four, five, six. I was not expecting that. I thought there was one more over here. Oh. Them animal hordes will fuck you up. 
for show, for show. Uh, now we got all that negative XP to work off. Holy shit, man. When I jumped down there, I was not expecting... I don't want... I need cobblestone? I'm confused. Why would I need cobblestone to... Fix that. for the center and it keeps well I'm gonna bust it out then there we go I just make another spike and put there it wouldn't let me wouldn't let me do anything god that was fucked up man was not expecting that at all Maybe I should use the knife. Oh, we're actually getting hide from that. Hide, bone, and um, rotten brains. Wow, they've changed that. It used to be rotten, rotten brains. When I when I started to hear the freaking. Um, Wood cat crackling, I had to get off because I, I didn't want them tearing down my pillar. The pillar is the main important thing. That's got all my shit in it. I don't think any of that's damaged. And see, they went through that spikes like it was butter. So... Once they hit me and put the hurting on me, I couldn't get away quick enough. There was too many of them, and they were all jumping. I should have went down the ladder instead of being such a dumbass. I was not expecting five fucking, five freaking poochies at all. I'm not sure I like this at all. We might just leave it open. Not really sure what I'm gonna do with it. Right now, we're just gonna keep it that way till I figure out what I'm gonna do. Maybe some kind of roofing. Probably not. I wonder if they got roofing under this. Well, I ended up dying anyway, guys, you know. Old Whiplash is trying to do this the right way. I do like these bookcases, though. Oh! They got crosses! Maybe the fun pimps actually listen to Whiplash after all. I have been asking, I don't know how long to have crosses in this game. Church cross. Thank you, fun pimps. Thank you. Thank you so much. That means a whole lot to me. Because I used to... I used to... Oh, yeah. Fun pimps. I don't care what I've said about you in the past. I love you now. Hell, I wonder if you could actually put this on here. Oh, look at that. That is so awesome. That actually takes up quite a bit. I mean, I don't care. Look at that. I won't have enough room. Can I pick it up? Yeah, I can pick it up. I won't have enough room. So what I would do is I would 
Oh, is that is that actually stuck up in the air? Or is it because of the... I'm confused. Yeah, that's like sitting up off the ground. So maybe... Ah, oh, yeah. It's kind of small, but you know... I wonder if you can write on it. Let's place it down. Pick up building block. Let's upgrade it. It's still cool. It is still cool. I like that. I like this better. Hello. I'm hitting the button and it's not. Oh. Hitting and the button and it just ain't a working. I do like this though. But it looks like it's sitting up off the ground. So. Oops. That's awesome. But it's sitting up off. Why is it sitting up off the ground? I couldn't put a. Like any dirt there. But that is awesome. I think I'm going to hang a couple up on the, the house. So, we're on Whiplash 5.0. I don't know if you can put a writing sign on them. Maybe the fun pimps listen to old Whiplash after all. I like that. That's cool. That is cool. That is awesome. Thank you, the fun pimps. Thank you, thank you, thank you. See, you know, I knew the fun pimps could do it. I really did. I don't know if I'm going to do this all the way around. I think if you do it all the way around the base, it's going to look a little too much. But we'll do it just for shits and giggles. Just to see what it looks like. We could put up one for each one that has passed. Maybe we can get a writable sign and put beside it Whiplash 1.0, Whiplash 2.0, 3.0, and 4.0. Yeah, I mean, I got two on the front. I'm on five. Yeah, so that's one, two, three, four, well, we'll have to pick these two up because I haven't died that many times yet. Thank you, fun pimps. I mean that. To me, that means they watch my videos. Somebody does. I don't know who, but I'm grateful. That means a lot to me. means a lot to me not like I've said and well since I started playing Alpha 21 um, it has been great I just don't like the water thing I can live with it and I can deal with it but that's the only thing I don't like about Alpha 21 so far <coughs> hell yeah anyway at the graveyards. See, it would always make a cross like this. When I would uh, do this. Hang on. I would just make a, like a simple cross. Nothing. Nothing fancy, right? I think I would. Let's see, three. I think I made it five high. 
One, two, three, four. Maybe it was five, huh? I would do something like this. I'm, I don't remember it being quite this big. No, it wasn't. I think it was just this. And then I would put a writable, a writable sign on the front of it. That's the way I would do it. I made a real cool one uh, once in Alpha 18. I think it was Alpha 18. Whatever, whenever I did my Wasteland Warrior series, I can't remember what Alpha that was. But uh, yeah, that's the way I would do it. And then put a writable sign on it. And I kept griping because they've got churches in this game and they've got crosses, but I could never find them even in the cheat menu. The blocks for them. I never could find them. So they, somebody, in my opinion, must have listened. To, whether it was me or somebody else, I'm grateful. Thank you. They just look so much better. I'll have to get some writable signs, though. Hell yeah. But I think old Whiplash is going to go for now, guys. I said I was going to go a few minutes ago and never did. But uh, I am going to go now. After I do a little bit of sorting, maybe? Uh, where my bacon and eggs go? I only made three bacon and eggs? I mean, I guess that's all right. Mm, I usually put this stuff with the seeds, too. Because that's how I make it, the drinkage. Put this guy back down here. I'll keep these guys with me. Hope we can put those up down here. Hell yeah. We're getting it. We are getting it. Uh, so next time, uh, I, I think what I'm going to do... Explosives don't go in there. Uh, I think the next time I know we're having an animal horde, I will jump off to the bike and get on the bike and take off. But see, that's just it. When any kind of horde shows up on your base, you need to get off of it or they're going to attack it. I mean, I wasn't up there maybe, what, 30 seconds and they already damaged this whole side. So that's my point. That's just a simple protection to protect my in, my most valuable column here. I could care less if the rest of this falls down. As long as I have my resources, I should be able to craft and make what I need and be okay. Um, but we're going to figure out something to put up over top of this. May eventually move some stuff around. I think I am going to go ahead and fill this in. I mean, I might as well. And here I go again. Here I go again. On face, copy rotation. Yeah, that way I'm not falling through. And if I do need to shoot at them, I can shoot at them. This gives me the perfect access to do it. So I think I am just going to fill it in. Wasn't going to in the beginning. I wanted it to look kind of cool, but it's just going to be a basic square now. Poochies made me learn my lesson today. I could have took the time... Until I notice them actually damaging the, the blocks, I could have taken the time to shoot at a couple of them, possibly killed them, rather than jumping down. So, it's okay. Lesson learned. Won't do again. Or I could have just sat down in my P2 chair and said to hell with it. <laughs> 
No, we can't let them damage this center column because that's where all our goodies are. That's good enough. Be no separations now. If anything, uh, I'll still think about putting the poles up and making some kind of awning over top of this. But we'll see. I like the openness of my base. That's I, I don't understand being all closed up inside and not being able to see out and see hordes coming and being able to prep yourself. But, oh well, it's already 10 o'clock. Um, I love that. Thanks, Fun Pimps. I'm going to upgrade them, of course, but that's pretty awesome. One up for every one that's died. And I might end up taking them down when I figure out how to manipulate the cross to where it looks like it's underground. But that's pretty awesome. Pretty awesome. Alright guys, hope you all enjoyed this video. If you did, please hit that like button guys. And if you all want to see more, subscribe to the channel. Everyone have a beautiful day. And God bless.